Once upon a time I was falling in love. Now I'm only falling apart. There's nothing I can do. A total eclipse of the heart. Turn around, bright eyes. Every now and then I fall apart. When I need you more than ever. When it all, it all, it all. It all, all, it all, 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 all. Boom! What's gravy, baby? We're going to be cracking open mystery booster boxes. That's right. We're going to be seeing what we can pull out of this nasty, nasty box. Thank you so much for tuning in, everyone. I appreciate you guys. Did you hear singing in the beginning? It was Patrick Long. It was Patrick Long all along. I know it's crazy. Patrick, you're a rascal. Let's see what we get out of this mystery booster box. Come on, baby. Show me the value, Daddy. Show me the value. All right. Okay, show me the value. Can, can we? Like, can this camera get any like crookeder? What is your deal? What's this? What's this camera's deal? She. What is? What's this camera's deal, man? All right, here we go. Good luck. Good luck. Hey, man. Guys, get, how is everyone doing today? Are you having a splendid day? We gotta go slow. I forget this. Okay, I'm gonna miss some things. Okay, I'm gonna miss some cards. I I'm gonna miss some births. Okay. That's just how it's going to go down. So please understand, I'm going to miss some price points here. There's just way too many prices to go over, man. Way too many, okay? I, I, it's just too much. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to organize by common and uncommon. Lay of the land. There you go, a little lay of the land action. Bada skadoosh. Okay, okay. Abundant growth. All right, come on. Let's, let's see some of that gold, Charlie. All right. Got the great furnace. Look at that thing. It's an artifact land. I guess if you want a lot of artifacts, aren't those banned or something? Like in everything, like just they're all banned. Contagion clasp, cool card. The old uh, burper belcher right here. Okay. Oh, <laughs> what is going on? Watch like the last four videos on the channel. Every single video, the first pack is insanity. <laughs> what is going on, Scourge boy? All right, man, feeling good already. Wow. Woke up today, got dumped on. Literally, there is like a foot and a half of snow in Cleveland, Ohio right now. Uh, did it snow last night? Asking for a friend. Ohio right now, laboratory maniac. Wow, nice pool, baby, nice pool. Um, yeah, I just got dumped on, so I'm gonna take the boy, um, my youngest, my, my baby, my one, my one, my one year old. We're going to go outside and try to make some cute photos in the snow because that's what people do in Cleveland, Ohio. We don't go to work. We just go in the snow. All right. We got Blightning Help in here. Crystal Chimes. There you go. Crystal Chimes. Doom Gape. Look at the size of that mouth, huh? What to do with all that extra space? Uh, Deep Glow Skater Boy. Said, see you later, boy. And then we got Wall of Shards. Could you imagine that? Just a Wall of Shards, huh? All right, keeping it trucking, baby. Keeping it trucking. Cast Out. That was a fun card during its standard, huh? Sacked in a play. All right, we got Raptor. Mr. Bolus, Path Major. Shinobi. Like Obi-Wan Kenobi? Because he's a rat ninja. You dig it? Good. All right, we got Motivator. And the current Wayfinder. A lot of commons up front. No, no, no uncommons yet. That could be a sign. Mist Meadow Witch. Man, it's been a while since we cracked one of these open. Feels really good though. Does it, you, you, you getting that feeling? You getting that feeling of some like some goodness? Look at that old school archangel. What do you want from her, man? What do you want from her? Everything. Vigor, welcome. I remember this card was like a $15, 20 card. No clue what the heck the price is at now. Probably not that much because it's been printed a lot. But powerful card, man. Game Trail Changeling. Look at that moose. It's Marty Moose, guys. Remember Marty Moose? No? Okay. Marty Moose? Someone knows who Marty Moose is out there. You got someone someone out there knows who Marty Moose is. Man, come on. Someone out there does. Marty Moose? No? Okay, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out together. Gust Walker, preordained. Just, just got reprinted in Commander of Legends. That's something there. Thought Collapser Boy. Dread Return. Okay, we're seeing some cards here. We're seeing some cards. We've got Dread Return. Nice art. Nice art. All right, man. It's been, yeah, it has been a while since we've done a mystery box, though. I feel like it's gone on a... Uh, um, oh my God. This card just never goes down in price ever. I swear, it, it just never goes down in price. It just goes up slowly, no matter how many times they freaking reprint it. 
It just is what it is, guys. It is what it is. Magus, Chromatic Lantern. There you go. Not bad. Although people are saying, don't play this in Commander anymore. That's what they're saying on the big Commander shows, man. There's enough two-mana mana rocks out there. You don't need it. Grand Architect Foil Rare. That's beautiful. That is chaotically gorgeous. Wow. Not bad at all, my friend. Okay. Not bad at all. What are you guys' thoughts on that? Like, do you just stop playing three uh, CMC mana rocks and just stick to the two because there's so many of them out there now? Like, you don't need to run three is what their argument is? I guess that makes sense. I guess that makes sense, right? I don't know. Yeah, I mean, you could. Uh, is it true? Are people actually doing that? Com and probably in competitive nature, I would imagine. That one little mana, it, it could be the difference between between winning and losing. You know, can't, can't, uh, can't, sand, sand it all. Okay, moving along. We got ourselves an imposter with approach of the second sun. Yeah, all right, okay. Oh, wow, we got ourselves a drug skull captain. This box is looking pretty hot, man. Other spirit creatures you control get plus one, plus one, and have hex proof. So that means you've got to go through him to get to the others. Unless you just board wipe them, and then that stupid card doesn't even matter. But moving along, let's see what else, man. Now, this box, so far, this box has been doing pretty, pretty good. You know what I'm saying? Pretty good, man. Pretty good box opening so far. All right, we got uh, Gulmog, Angla. Sees competitive play. It's nuts, I know. I don't even know if Wizards thought that this card would see competitive play when they printed it. I wonder what their thoughts are on that were. Look at that old school art, man. It's cool stuff. Throw a possibility. Fade into antiquity. All right. Seek the horizon, baby. Go on seeking. Seek and destroy. All right. We got Chimera, Darksteel, Citadel. Oh, Dragon Brood Moth. This thing is nasty. Just read what that thing does. I don't even want to say what it does. Just go ahead and read that text, guys. Are you reading that text? Shh. So I'll just take a moment. Yeah? Did you read it? Isn't that just insanity? It is a really cool card. I like it. Oh! Freaking Sliver Hive Lord Daddy O. Nasty freaking card, man. There you go. I love Slivers. I love Slivers. And we just got the freaking Brood Moother. Oh, Manor Tanner from Danny Tanner, Full House Land. That is a Sliver Hive Lord, baby. Get out of here. And Pika's Mischief. Wow. You're doing fantastic, man. Um, I'm loving it. Like Mickey D's, right? You know? No? Extra cheese? Don't get extra cheese, guys. These are heart attacks. Damn, just, just, you don't want heart attacks. All right. Okay, we got this. I'm praying for people out there. Um, I actually had a few fans I talked to in the last week um, that uh, either have gone through like a, a, tri a quadruple bypass surgery or double bypass or you know, all the kind of stuff who've just suffered from heart attacks. I've been talking to a lot of people out there in the community. Um, and it just seems to be a topic that, that, that they're bringing up, like, out of nowhere. It's kind of, it's kind of strange, but, um, at the same time, like, hey, maybe this is something that should be discussed. Guys, watch what you're eating, man. Like, myself as well. I'm not special. I eat some junk every now and then. I love cheese. I love dairy. But, gosh darn it, my friends, we gotta start staying away from that stuff, you know? If it's gonna lead to an early demise, no one wants any of that, you know, so... Be uh, be be very uh, be very aware of what you're what you're putting into your body, okay? Immortality and Iron Mirror, ladies, that goes for you too. We got an Iron Mirror. That's a nice heavy foil. Like I feel these foils way more than like normal foils, you know? All right, let's see. We got Core Sky Fisher. Mm hmm. Let's go. Let's see what we got. This dude, is he, he's like a jailer. He locks some people up and stuff. All right, we got the Trail of Evidence. Good times. Good times. Good times. <sighs> Okay, moving along. Grim Affiction. There's so many cards here, it's nutty. Doing a price video on this, I'm assuming, would just be chaotic. But maybe I should. You guys have been acting, you, you've been asking for the price videos, so maybe we should. Pilgrim's Eye. But man, this video is going to take a long time. Release the ants. Look at those little guys. <laughs> so if I did pricing in this video, definitely hit the like button. <laughs> Release the ants. Cool card, cool card. Ark of Oraska. Bada bing. And Braid of Fire. Cool. There you go. Nice, crazy cumulative upkeep. Add a red mana to your mana pool. That's a pretty good cumulative upkeep. Uh, yeah, that is a nasty card right there. Just like, I could, I could just size up a card just by what it says. Just by what it says, you know. Does it say something on it? I can tell you. 
I can tell you if it's good. I can tell you if it's bad. I can tell you if it's worth money. Not always, because some cards I might not know how many times they were printed. But then again, usually the ones that are worth, like, um, uh, that are worth nothing that, you know, are really, really good. That's because, you know, they were just printed into oblivion. You know, there are cards like that. So that's, that's you know, an exception. That's a dark dabbling right there, okay? Covenant of Blood, Earth Elemental Boy, Molten Rain. Purple Rain, Purple Rain. All right, we're going all out today, baby. We got the Root Out. Oh, what are the odds, huh? What are the odds? Unbelievable. Lonnie showing up, Reflector Mage. Whoosh, right back at you. That's right. Cool card. What's banned in standard? Fountain of Renewal, okay. Corrupted cons Conscience. Conscience. Conscience? I don't want to talk anymore. Oh, Doretti Confetti! What's up already? Man, we got him. All right, cool. Planeswalker. Not bad. Doretti Scrap Confetti. There you go. He does some fun things. Good old Doretti. I was not expecting to see a Planeswalker. I think I have him uh, in like a Mythic Edition like foil thing or something. Stigma Lasher. Is it just me or are you pulling a lot of like rare foils and Mythics and, and like good cards? Is it just me or is that is that what... Maybe I haven't done a mystery booster box in a while, and these things kind of just, like, snuck under the bus, you know? Like, like they, they, they snuck under the bus. I had a dream last night. Someone got hit by a bus. Whoa, man, just brought back a memory of my dream. Okay, moving along. Damn, man, having mind-blown kind of stuff going on here, guys. Mind-blown. I just woke up, by the way. You know, I, I hear the stupid comments some of you say. When, when Joe, oh, what are you on today, Joey? Oh, 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 dancing with Snow White again, are you, Joey? No, no. Um, I, when I wake up in the morning, that's when I have the most energy. And I can, I, I just, like, I can't stop talking, you know. Um, mainly because I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. It's a sad topic, man. All right, moving along. We got riders, but I have a lot of, I have a lot of energy in the mornings. Eldritch Evolution. Boom. All right, and Harmonic Sliver Foil. Daddy-O, you are getting a nice box, man. A really nice box. I got to say, I, uh, I I was not looking forward to even cracking this, but what the heck was I thinking? Um, this has been really good. We got to stay, uh, stave off. There you go. I don't know if that's worth anything. Soul Parade, Hermit Boy. That's right. Holy man. It's been a wild ride, baby. A wild ride. Funniest movie you ever saw. What is the funniest movie you ever saw? All right, I'm going to tell you what I, in my opinion, what I think right now, baby. And there's a lot out there. But one that stands out among the rest. Okay, among the rest. I'm not a second reflector mage. Well, um, is going to be Walk Hard, the Dewey Cox story. That is seriously one of the stupidest Funniest videos I have ever, ever seen. Ever. Like, it is really, really hilarious, man. Like, it's stupid slapstick humor. And I'm going to tell you right now. I, I, ha, ha, look at that boy. Whoosh, what happened to that boy? Whoop, what happened to that boy? We got a birdie. Um, I'm going to tell you right now. Um, the first, like, ten minutes when you start watching it for the very first time, you're going to be like, all right, Joey, this movie's stupid. I guarantee you're going to think that. I, I guarantee you're going to think that. Get past that 10-minute mark, all right? And 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 just take this take the movie serious. And wait till you see that it's a beautiful ride. All right? Just wait, man. You're going to you'll you'll see for yourself. And then I guarantee you the second time you watch it, it's, it's going to be funnier and then the third time you watch it, it's going to be funnier than the second. Like just wait, man. And it's one of those movies you'll go back to again and again. Uh, Dewey Cox, man, a beautiful, oh, no, not a beautiful, uh, Dewey Cox, um, Walk Hard. It is just too funny of a movie, man. Okay, we got Floodgate, boom, all right, Gonti, Lord of Luxury, there you go, showing some pennies, I don't know if that's an uncommon, I think so, Gonti, Lord of Luxury, with a whole lot of text on it, and Ogre Gate Crusher for a foil, cool, man, yeah, I love that movie, but, you know, what, what funny movies have you guys seen lately? I feel like I'm more myself in the morning than any other time. Like, I'm more, like, talkative. Like, I have a personality and stuff, you know? Yay, you know? Okay, anyway. Lawless Broker. Boosh. Okay. We got Lacerator. Mm-hmm. Milwaukee. We got Urge. Man, a lot of comments in the beginning. Shape the Sands. What does it mean? What does it mean, Jellybean? Citadel. Castellan. Look at that. Look at that sword. 
Oh, she's a slayer. She has vigilance and renown deucer. She's pretty tough. Oh, what is this? Evolving wild. Sacrifice evolving wild. Search your library for a basic land card. Put it on the battlefield and tap and shuffle your library. <laughs> Library. What? That's got to be busted, dude. That is seriously the nastiest ability on a card. When did they print this? 2018? That must have been its first printing. That card is sick. Nice freaking pool, pal. That is dirty, man. Oh, and an impending disaster. Oh, my goodness. Let this. Oh, my God. I can't believe this pool's involving wilds. Impending disaster on top of it to punt. Pretty legit. Mimic Vat. Wow, what a box, man. This, I, 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 this, there's so many different cards. How many cards are in this set? Hey, how many cards are in this? Somebody tell me how many cards are in this set right now. How many cards? Someone look it up. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm looking right now. Oh, my God. There's like 1,600 cards in this set. There's like 1,690, like 90, roughly. 1,690, rough estimate. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. 600. Wow. There's 1,694 cards in this set. 1,694 cards in this set. Holy crap. And we got Sakuru Tribe Scouts. There you go. Oh my gosh, man. That's a lot of freaking cards. What do you even do with all those? Okay. Wow. I didn't realize that many cards were in the set. But then again, I, it's been a while, you know. All right, Castaways, Dragon Boy. Come on, Daddy-O. Let's get some seismic shifting going on in the downstairs mix-up. <sighs> Grape Shot. This card never sees play anywhere. It'd be cool if it did, you know. But it, I don't know. It'll, maybe one day they'll find synergy with that card. Who knows? All right, we got uh, I Lanes and Ozone, uh, Azuri's Archers coming at you, baby. Grim Contest. All right, all right. There we go. Blossoming Sands. There we go. Okay. Oh, come on, baby. Another freaking dirty god. That's a god of passage, man. That's a good pull. <laughs> like, that's really, really juiced up right there. That's like a more a pricey god. That is a god of the goodness. He was once like 35 bucks. Whoa, bro. Wow. Drana looking gorgeous. Flopping out the fun boys, huh? Man, unbelievable. Unbelievable. You had a really fun opening, man. I, I I don't know what else to say. Look at a hornet sting. Okay, stop it, man. Who tuned out when I did that? All right, all right, moving along, moving along. <laughs> we have fun, we have fun. Hot dogs, hot dogs, hot dogs. Okay, fortify some of this. The helix distraction. Don't get distracted. Don't get distracted. Here we go, baby. Here we go. I love you guys. Oh, Amisha. Rhymes with amnesia. I think I'm going to have amnesia at a very early age. Yeah. I mean Alzheimer's. That's what I meant to say. <laughs> Dolem Gate. Wow. There you go. Fun card. Uh, this card was down in the dumps for a while, but then it started going up a little bit. Gideon Yora. Cool. Another Planeswalker. But um, yeah, not one we wanted to really see. Uh, but that's our second uh, Planeswalker in this box. Wow. This has been a really good box, man. What is up? What is up, bro? Well, well, this is like a really good one. I gotta say, your Japanese War of the Spark, not so great. Except for that one uh, that one card you pulled, man. But other than that, like, just kind of, you know, like, it was kind of, eh, you know, eh, you know. But then this, 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 my friend, totally redeemed yourself. Like, you have really freaking done it this time, pal. Unbelievable. This box is just hitting on all freaking, uh, on all notes, you know. We're just firing off on all cylinders. You know, hitting and splitting and flipping a vapor snag over here, you know. Sometimes we get that murderous compulsion to just go out and do some patrolling. Walking up and down the streets till we come across a nasty vampire, you know. And then we throw him up in a furnace. That's not good. He's going to burn up and there. But, man, maybe that, maybe a turn timber basilic might come to his rescue. Probably not, though, because he heard he has worms. And no one wants that. But, you know, if you're charming enough, you know, uh, you can give anyone worms. Uh, and with that being said, you're probably have to find an inspector to check that out, you know. Get your downstairs mixed up, all looked at, you know. I'm sure, I'm sure. I'm sure there's a scourge hacking around there that you can just enjoy. What a freaking card right there. Wow. And a door to pouncer, you know, to sniff it out. 
But, you know, hopefully you can get that all cured up. Otherwise, you're going to have a lightning storm of problems, my friend. Wow, look at that storm boy. That is slick. Gotta love the art on Magic. Okay, baby, you are, uh, yeah. Ooh, all right, doing more, baby, doing more. I'm close to getting the shift out to you. I think there's what? Is this the last box we have for you to, that I'm opening of yours? Or is there something else I'm missing? I feel like there's one more box of something I'm missing. Maybe not. I don't know. All right. We got uh, the eel, the emperor, the moon glove, moon glove, prospector. Cool, cool. Blast boy. Sulfurous blast. All right. Uh, Tusker, Tuscarora. Woo. Weep. Okay. We're getting there. Thron Dynamo. Boop, 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 boop. All right. A little bit of value there. A little bit of value. Cool, cool. And the shrieker. You, come on, you had to see that coming. You had to see that coming. Nice card. Cool, cool. Nice throwback. Ah, oh, gosh. Oh, man. Box is good, guys. I cough away. Box is good. Box is so good. That's a freaking El Norn Grand Santa Bite. Unbelievable. You are on fire. <laughs> Dude, I've never seen a box this good in my entire freaking history of like whatever I've been doing for four years on Magic the Gathering. Okay, in, in my defense, it's been a while since I opened this product, and there's like almost 1,700 cards. I had no idea the prices tanked as bad as they have. Um, some of these cards like were easily 5, 10, 20, 30, 40 bucks, you know, but since the reprints and everything, and even printing something as Mythic Foil... The prices have just dropped, man. You know, the original one could be worth 18 bucks, but the reprint's like a dollar fifty. It's like, oh man. So yeah, in my defense, you know, this has been kind of a hard watch. Uh, because just so many times I thought we had something pretty solid or good. And I've been proven a fool uh by the value of the price. But hey, if you like the art though, that's exciting. Skadoosh. Look at this thing. Flying haze, tired of junk uh comes into play. Gain control of all dragons and untap all dragons. Other dragon creatures you control have, hey, 7-7. Seven, seven. That's a Jund dragon freaking legend right there. Beautiful. Wow. This is uh, this might be the best box I've ever seen opened of mystery boxes. And I've pulled Mana Crypts out of boxes before. But I think this box is better. And Mana Crypts are all the way down to 75 bucks right now, guys. Um, did you know that? For this version, at least. I mean, that's, that's pretty insane, bros. That's pretty insane. Got the gambit. Elves of Deep Shadow. Ooh, yeah. Dirty girl. All right. A little bit of Hydra. Come on, Kingpin. Anyone bowling lately? I love bowling. I used to be on a league when I was 11 years old. I won every freaking trophy you could possibly win in that league. Frogmite? No lie. Violent Ultimatum, baby. I can still bow to this day. Pretty good. At my average is low, though. Like, I'm not... I, I haven't played... I don't pull that much. My average, I'd say, is probably like 174, 175, something like that. It's nothing crazy. Destroy three target permanents. There you go. And the Marari Conjecture. I know some guys, they got, uh, like, averages of, like, 198, 201. I'm like, you guys are nuts, you know? Uh, they're, they're out there. Bowling's fun, though. Bowling's fun. Would you ever have taken me as a bowler? I also played baseball, basketball, football, soccer, uh, tennis. I did, dude, I did everything. I, you name it, I have done it. I have done it all, man. I have done it all. Propaganda, bada boosh. Cool card right there. Laboratory Maniac, there's so much value, man, in this set. I swear, Helix Boy, there is so much value in this set. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I know we're going to, I probably miss some. I probably miss some factoring in. I know, I'm sorry, guys. Cliffy's Dark Steel Garrison. Looking at this card, you'd be like, wow, that looks like it's worth something. Cabbage. And you're just like, let down, you know? Oh, Chasm Skulker. This card I always look at, and I think it's worth something, too. This one might be, though, compared to the other one. Cool card, the old Skulker, and Allosaurus Rider. Man, just some good all-around value coming out of these, you know? Some good all-around humble little value. Five packs to crack. Hey, I had fun with this one. If you guys enjoyed your time watching this video, make sure you hit the like at the end. Um, you know, if you were entertained at all, by all means, hit that like, man. If you're a pondering mage, make sure you hit that like. All right, Invoker. Fretwork Colony. Okay. Can't can't block. There you go. I don't remember that card, but I guess it, it's a thing. So there you go. All right. We got Sylvan Scrying. Why are you always scrying? All right. Here we go. We Dragonauts. Again. Jungle Shrine. That's not bad. I think these kind of cards are pretty cool. They produce a lot of different manas. 
And there's a Battlefield tap. Add blank, 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 or blank. There you go. Oh, I smelled you, baby. Oh, you smell good under there, girl. Oh, let me get a, hold on, let me get a sniff. Oh, yeah. There you go. That's good. That's what dreams are made of. Lotus Petal, baby. Nice pool, my friend. Nice pool. Very good. Tenth with Discovery. I don't even know about this card. And you are doing fantastic. This has been, I think, again, one of the best box openings of this I've seen. Teferi's Puzzle Box. The hits keep on coming, baby. Wow. Talk about freaking value Oso, my friendo. Four to go, baby. Come on, Patrick Long. Let's let's finish this out. Let's finish this out, baby. Let's finish this out. Champion, deep analysis. Oh, got a little ding on there. I can't, I can't, I can't help some of these dings. I didn't do them. Ding, ding, down. All right, Centaur, Behemoth. Got the old Druid, Rivals Druid. Blast Fire, cool, cool. Oosh. Captain, my captain. All right, there you go. Bladewing the Risen. Not to be confused with Ryzen. That's right. Familiar. And Phyrexian Metamorph. Yeah. Okay, there you go. One of our rares. And the Sky Summoner. Not sure why she was reprinted, but she was. This card is one of those that sees a lot of reprints, man, but it's just good. It's just good, bro. Yeah, Patron of the Moon. Appreciate all my patrons out there. Thank you so much. Uh, delays on shipping, though, for multiple reasons. I'm so sorry. You guys are going to get everything. Just it's, Joey Moss has had a freaking rough month, man, um, in his personal life. That's all I'm going to say about that. Um, that, that, that that's all I want to say on that. So just know that, but I'm going to get there, okay? I am going to get it done. I'm going to get it done. Don't worry. Travel of Evidence, it's coming. We're gonna be, we're, it's coming, I swear. I'll address patrons also on Patreon. Uh, Vigor, Invocation, Scrapper. And who the heck is still watching this video right now? If you're watching this video at this point, 25, almost 26 minutes in, man, let me know this box. This is in the comments. Say this box was amazing. Uh, or something along those lines. I've never seen nothing better than this box. Or like, this is the best mystery box. Something like that. I'll know that you're watching. This is seriously one of the best boxes, though. Energy Field and Cathodian. But I appreciate you guys being this late in the game watching this. That Cathodian might be worth something, I would imagine, maybe. Energy Field, cool, from Urza Saga. One of my favorite sets. Swords of Animist. That's legit. Man, the value is all over the best mystery boxes, man. They're nuts. Sleepers. Norn the Wary. Gosh. This is a stu I, I, This makes me want to get a mystery box now. Anybody else? Like, don't you just want to grab a mystery box now? <laughs> Got two more packs still. Like, there's been so much value out of this freaking thing, man. Um, according to TCG Player, these boxes are selling for roughly 160 to 170 right now, and and it's more teetering teetering towards the 170 and up range. So, there you have it, man. <sighs> Nutty. Rancor. That is an error. Should have had in one colorless next to it. Very powerful card. All right. Got the Gorger. Got the Gorger with Abisha. Wirewood Lodger. Come on. What are we going to get at the end, baby? Wayfarer. There you go. Search your life for a land card. Reveal it. Put it into your hand. Shuffle your library. Put it opponent controls. Okay. Yeah. There's always a stipulation with that. That'd be cool if you could just continuously do it. Then again, this card would be busted. Anger of the Gods. Really, really a cool card. Nice uh, board wiper there. Pool from Eternity. Bada boosh. Okay. Last pack to crack. What are we going to pull out of the very last pack? Pressure point. Here we go. Alley Invasion. Ooh, what are we going to pull out the last pack, baby? It's all about this last. Keep it juicy. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Velocity. Bounty. Watcher. Glade Watcher. Blade Wing Arisen. Okay. Real blinding soul eater. Ooh, got the Phyrexian man up in that one. That's cool. Eater of days. Look at this big old lunka. Imagine pulling that out of the ocean, huh? Flying trample. When eater of days comes into play, you skip your next two turns. If that had haste on it, yes. But that's terrible. Come on, cabbage. Al Maharit's Archive. Man, I'm telling you, last pack moss is back, baby. I remember this card was four bucks. It's way up there now. Wow, last pack moss. It's been the first and last pack for so many freaking videos. Unbelievable, friends. Thank you for journeying with me on this beautiful ride, guys. I really enjoyed your time here. I hope you enjoyed yours. I just want to say... Aliens!